Let's do my makeup! <laughs> Starting off with my lips. This is my daytime. Supposed to help with anti aging and acne, but as you can see, it doesn't help with that. But it has made the lines go down. Now, oh, a hydration all these little samples from Ipsy and Birchbox, so I always have to cut milk. And then I get all my brushes and I just drop them on my bed. Primer. Then it takes even longer. <laughs> Mac. That's my number one. I use a lot of Mac products. I know it's probably why I have that. <laughs> but give me something else that works just as good and I'll change. For now. Except for the color. This is my summer color and my face is a winter color. In the house. Don't be afraid to tell me if you went with. I'm gonna focus on you so I can. So I just blend, 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 blend all the way down. <laughs> I'm aggressive because I go fast. Because I got kids. Gotta get it done before someone asks for something. Right? And I know I should do my eye makeup first. I do sometimes when like I'm getting ready for a big like for an event or something and I want to look really pretty. But hey Alexa, volume three. Alexa, volume three. Oh, bronzer, contour. And I just put it right under the cheekbone. But not right here because then I look all like. And then my nose. Movie magic, baby. Double chin, man. Sides a little bit. Already better, huh? And now, Mac. Blush. It's a little almost empty, huh? Let's go crazy! Crazy! Voila. Easy breezy. 
and now it gets a little complicated because it's the eye makeup. So I always gotta. So if it's an event or something, I usually use a like primer on my eyes. But today, mm, what else? So I'm not using. It. But when I do, I use Morphe. For the primer. The key is to knock off. Makeup. Luckily, I haven't done my eye makeup yet. That's why I do the dab for the eye makeup. Tricks. If you do cough, it doesn't mess up your eye makeup. these brushes and <coughs> this Morphe palette which is pretty fun. I like a lot of gold. Gold and brown. My colors. Mm-hmm. Mostly gold. <laughs> Chanel. And then all my brushes. But I really don't use all these brushes. I usually only use like four brushes. So I'm gonna start off with the light brush. That's why I literally just call it the light brush. It's light, the lightest color. Out. And I go for my lightest color, usually like a white. Alright. Then I 
go back in with the light. There's another light there to kind of blend. It's all blend. Look, prison? I don't like to use eyeliner unless it's like a freaking like event or something because I want to like look special at my events. So I just get like my thin angle brush. This one's from that. And I go in with like a dark color. And put it on my lash line. But only half line. face products, MAC, eye products, mostly Morphe, unless it's like a tester, and then my eyebrow products are Anastasia, Anastasia, oh, I don't know, whenever they're all fancy dancy, and this, I just learned how to do recently, so please, Oh my goodness, you have a lollipop? Okay, that's okay. I'm trying to do my eyebrows. <laughs> and it's scary. Try and go along your lash line. Oh. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna be a scary, mean lady today. You get to choose your emotions by your eyebrows, ladies and gentlemen. You didn't know that, but now you do. You are not what you are on the inside. You are what you are drawn on the outside. So kidding. Really, just kidding. But you can mask the appearance of happiness or surprisingness by your eyebrows. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, what else? At this point, I just kind of need to give up or else I'm going to be even scarier in 2.5 seconds. So, we move on to the other side. And now, it's going to make it look like I did this on purpose. Well, there we go. It wouldn't be any better if I like used a bigger mirror. Because 
this is how I do it. I even with all the mirrors in the universe. There. The rule to live by. My sister taught me this, and she's a genius. She's younger than me, but she's a genius. Makeup extraordinaire. Your eyebrows are sisters, not twins. Voila. What's going on? And then you just step back. It looks fine. Just go with it. Because if you mess with it too much, you start looking like a psychopath. And then you get some more 101 cannabis. And you stick it into the whole spoon. Because you're almost done, so you gotta celebrate. I could, and I did, and I'm happy but sad at the same time because that means <laughs> But it's okay. We will survive, right? Because we only have one left. One thing left to do, and that is our mascara. At least for me. I don't do, like, lip shit. Silver mascara, my go-to, 100% of the time, is CoverGirl Lash Blast. Black is black, not waterproof. This is amazing! Literally. But it's almost empty, so I use my samples that I get in my Birchbox and Etsy to make up for it. But I use the brush and this to get it started. Kinda silly, I know, but what else? A little bit of a cheapskate, I guess, also. That I won't just go buy another. <laughs> it's okay though. I've almost bought it, like, a couple times, actually. I pick it up. And then I'm like, I can't spend like six dollars on this. I have other things to buy, and then I put it back. So I start off with this mascara, kind of coat it with as much as I can. My, like my little tip would be to get down to the root and then do this twisting motion with your fingers. It really like helps bring your eyelashes and make them look fabulous. And then this is their real by Benefit. Not my favorite. This is my one that I use when I'm not going out. The one that I use when going out of the samples is Bad Gal Bang by Benefit. I love that one. It makes my eyelashes look neat. But with I've noticed that so you, if you get mascara on the tip and then go to the and then just roll it up. It really works. It's like the best technique ever. Never fails me. And then just put some on the bottom without getting some on the skin. Because that is just plain suck. <laughs> it really does suck when you, that messes up your makeup. And then you move on. And don't go overboard or else you might regret it. Ah. So, I use this one to cover.
Then if you want to get a little like crazy, go in with a little brush and the like lightest color, funnest, sparkliest color. Go in the crease. And you go right along the brow line to the bottom. And can't forget, let's do the fix. This is like a priming spray. It just reminds me of like the smell is so amazing. It reminds me of like summer and like the beach, and I don't know. It's just back in the day, I think, actually. But, there you go. <laughs> Makeup by Breezy. <laughs> oh, we got some water spots, huh? Love you guys. Have a wonderful day.